What's up guys, it's CJ from SmartKTai.com. If you want the new keyboard from Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich, now's your chance to get it on your Android 2.2 Froyo or 2.3 Gingerbread powered smartphone. Someone over at XDA has extracted it, presumably from the new Samsung Galaxy Nexus, and the APK install file is now available to download for free. And I should mention that root is not necessary, so anybody can install it. I'll place a link for it in the description below with information on how you can get it. So let's give it a quick spin to see how it performs. As you can see on the left we have the gingerbread keyboard on an Nexus S and on the right we have the new Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich keyboard on a Sprint Samsung Galaxy S2 which of course runs gingerbread. So I'm going to remove the Nexus S so we can focus on the ICS keyboard. Alright so first things first let me cycle through the various layouts. Here we have some numbers and symbols and of course you can tap and hold on keys to get more options and you can see the space bar has been expanded so it looks like that's much more convenient to use uh, and up at the top we have our usual suggestions box but let's go ahead and put that to the test so I typed in this is a test and you can see the middle key has three dots that tells you you can tap and hold and then you get more options so pretty convenient there I'm going to go ahead and go with test and then it reverts to the punctuations uh, that you can choose from. Alright, so I've zoomed in a little closer. Let's give it a longer test. Checking out the keyboard from Ice Cream Sandwich on the Samsung Epic 4G touch from Sprint. Checking out the keyboard from Ice Cream Sandwich on the Samsung Epic 4G Touch from Sprint. So as you can see not bad, it performs well, corrects well, uh, but there are some missing features here. Uh, for instance, vibration doesn't seem to be working on my particular device. I've seen in the forums that some people have been able to get vibration working but it doesn't work on mine. Uh, also you'll notice that voice input is missing. I've disabled that because it doesn't work at all. I'm not sure if that's related to the new voice typing feature in Android 4.0 where it transcribes your words in real time using your voice, but unfortunately it's not working at the moment. Uh, hopefully the developers will get on it and at least make it compatible with the current implementation on Gingerbread, but until they do, uh, we just have these basic or core features. Uh, when they do get that out there, I'll go ahead and update the post on smartketai.com uh, with the correct download. So let's go ahead and tilt in landscape mode just so you can see what that looks like. As you can see, it looks pretty good there. You have your offset keys. Uh, for some reason, it's not offset at the bottom, but uh, maybe that won't be too much of an issue. So this was a look at the ice cream sandwich keyboard running on gingerbread. Again, I'll place a link for the download in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please comment, rate, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.